The United Auto Workers strike against the big three is expanding here in Michigan. 6,800 UAW members walked off the job today at the Sterling Heights Stellantis plant that makes Ram trucks. Since the strike started on September 15th, more than 40,000 workers have now joined the picket line. TV5's James Felton talked to strikers at the Davison Road Processing Center in Burton who are now in their fifth week on the picket line. I agree with Sean Fain on what he's saying. I think the company does have more to give. Um, however, I don't know that we're going to get that. Um, but I have faith that the negotiators and uh, everybody down in Detroit knows what they're doing. UAW Local 651 member Craig Simpson is on strike at the Davison Road Processing Center in Burton. While he has some worry about UAW President Sean Fain saying the big three have more money left to spend as UAW leadership holds out for a better deal, he also has concerns about some claims GM has made in its latest offer to the UAW. I also don't agree with some of the things the company is saying as far as and maybe I'm wrong here, but they're saying 23% increase over the life of the contract would get us up to $40 an hour. That's not the math that I'm getting now. Maybe that's based in with cost of living. I don't know. Today, the UAW expanded its strike to a Stellantis plant in Sterling Heights. It's a move Simpson supports. This is our fifth week out here at this plant. Uh, the original three plants that went out, they've been out six weeks now. So... Um, yeah, we have plenty of cards to play. I mean, there's still a lot of plants that have been working this whole time, you know. So, sure, we, we have tons of leverage, really. Given that, Simpson thinks he and his fellow UAW members are getting closer to having a tentative agreement to vote on. I would much rather be in there working, you know. But this isn't just about me. This isn't just about those of us out here today. This is about everybody, you know. And we keep falling further behind and people just can't keep up. Reporting in Burton, James Felton, WNEM, TV5. And make sure you stay with TV5 for the very latest on the UAW strike against the Big Three.